Well, good afternoon, folks, or good morning, or good evening, depending on what time of day it is where you are. Lovely to see you again, and thank you very much for popping over just to check out what I got in this month's Degusta box. So this is the UK October unboxing, and if you want to win yourself this month's box, stay on till the end, and I'll tell you how you can get yourself entered to win one. I am very kindly sent these boxes every month from Degusta box, you know, just for unboxing and showing you and telling you how it works so thank you very much to you guys for watching and thank you to Degusta Box for sending the box my way. I've also got my own subscription and that's the one that I give away, not the PR box. <laughs> but just before I move on, I wanted to say a massive thank you to the supporters of the channel over on my Patreon page. So thank you once again, guys. So I'm just going to tell you a wee bit about how the box works. But if you've heard all this before, you know, feel, feel free to skip forward a minute or so. But Degusta Box, if you didn't know, it's a monthly subscription box. It's a kind of snack and food discovery box. It lets you find new brands or new products you might not normally buy or usually walk by in the supermarket, you know, and not pick up. And I found some amazing things through these boxes. Or you might be sent things that have been out for a while, you know, tried and tried trusted brands and products that you'd forgotten actually existed and then you try them again and you think oh yeah I remember that so it can be an absolute mix of anything sometimes we get alcohol chocolate you know soft drinks bread products it can be absolutely anything and that's what I like about it is the element of surprise and you don't know what you're going to get until it comes to your door there's normally a theme every month or a kind of loose theme and you will always get flyers in your box which is a good indication of things that are in your box and you also get your product information card and on there you'll have everything that's in your box along with further information prices and where you can buy the products should you like them and want to go in and purchase them for yourself. The box is normally £12.99 per month and that includes your shipping within the UK obviously but if you want to save yourself some money you can get your first box for £9.99 including your postage if you use the code that's on the screen at the moment but I'll also leave all of this information in the show more box underneath. Your box is delivered by courier and on the day of delivery you will get a text message and an email letting you know when your box is arriving within a couple of hours. So it's always really handy to know and if you're not going to be in you can obviously rearrange delivery or get them to leave it somewhere else. So that's basically how it works. So let me go and show you the box and I'll, you know typical contents and what you should receive month to month. So yeah let's go and dive in. So like I said, you'll always get flyers in your box and the first one out the box was a promotional flyer for their yearly advent calendar. So this is the 2020 advent calendar and this is actually on the way to me. I'll be getting two of these, one that I've bought myself, I will be giving away to one of you guys. And then we had another flyer from St Pierre, it's for their brioche buns and some flyers from Ollie's pretzels. Again, a good indication of things that are in your box. And then also a redeemable coupon for strings and things. These are yogurt lollies. And then the Yes bars, which are protein bars, are also in the box. This month's theme is movie night and Halloween. So just perfect for the spooky season. And here's a wee sneak peek. So the first thing out the box were these Reese's Minis peanut butter cups. Now, I just love these. I am on a bit of a diet just now, but I think I might have to pinch a couple of these because this is one of my favourite things. I love these. And then we had from the flyers, you know, as an indication of things that are in the box, were these Ollie's pretzels. There are two different varieties in the box. These are their new thinner pretzels, which are quite low in calories. They're both under 100 calories per bag. So a brilliant low calorie snack for on the go. So you will get both varieties in your box. And I just can't wait because I do love pretzels as well. The next product out the box we have seen before and this is a Taka Snack Nacho Kit and I really enjoyed these the last time. I think it was a few months ago we got these and these ones are actually suitable for vegetarians which is fab. Out of the box next with these Wahoo chocolate filled crepes. Now I know these are aimed at kids but I had these in a different box not that long ago from the same brand and they are wonderful. You get eight in here and I know they're aimed at kids but yeah I just love these. Yeah, Highly recommended if you see these. 
The next thing out of the box were some St. Pierre brioche buns. If you watch my weekly shopping hauls, you'll know that I do buy brioche rolls quite often. These are the rolls that we like to have with our burgers and these ones are ultra soft and they're pre-sliced as well. So you don't even have to cut them through the middle. That's done for you. So yeah, I'll look forward to using those during the week. The next thing out of the box was a jar of hot chocolate. This comes in this size jar, a smaller jar, and they also do sachets as well. And I just love the packaging here. It reminds me of a sort of old fashioned sweetie jar. You can obviously reuse these jars once you've used all the products. So yeah, fab. Now the next thing out of the box, now if you follow me over on Instagram, you will know that I go to Costa Coffee every single day and I have done for years. Costa Coffee is a, a large chain of coffee shops over in the UK, a bit like Starbucks in the States, you know, they're ultra popular and we do go every day and this is an instant coffee, obviously, that they do. I had no idea that they'd done instant coffee. I know that they, you know, they grind their own beans and you can buy them that way, but instant coffee brilliant I'm super happy to see that so yeah fab the next product out of the box was from Naked. Now, I've got to admit, I'm not the biggest fan of Naked, you know, their products anyway. We have tried quite a lot of their stuff now and, yeah, never really keen. But this is a rendang curry veg pot and all of their stuff, you know, they're all vegetarian. I'm not sure if they're vegan, but all of their stuff is vegetarian. So, yeah, you might be interested, you know, if you're a veggie, but not something that we'll probably enjoy. But I will pass it on to somebody else. The next couple of things out of the box were these Yes bars. Now, we do see Yes quite a lot in the boxes, and these are actually healthy snacks that we do enjoy. They're just so tasty. A couple of years ago, I'd have looked at something like this and went, oh no, not for me. But since, you know, getting these boxes and being introduced to more of these kinds of things, they are surprisingly nice. And if you're looking at them, think, no, no, give them a go. Then the next thing out of the box was a flapjack from Bryn Mawr. Now this is a Welsh company and again another brand we see quite a lot and these flapjacks are just full of good stuff and again surprisingly tasty. Now the next thing out of the box I was excited to see and it's a massive box of Kit Kat Senses. These are individually wrapped um, at sort of wee mini Kit Kats. There are three different flavours in there. So you've got the praline, the salted caramel and the double chocolate and these will be perfect for sitting in front of the TV. You know it's just a big sheer box and these are what I would call a sort of Christmas chocolate. Something I would put away and have you know if you're watching a movie or something like that. And the last thing in the box was just a wee free gift from Cookie Cat and it's Wild Berries. It says here it's a tempting red colour and irresistible taste. A lovely combination of tender cacao butter drops and sweet with bitter sour taste of lingonberries. Just one bite and there's no turning back. So never heard of the brand. No idea what that is but I'll certainly open it up, give it a sniff and maybe a bite. So that was our box this month. So what did you think? I thought it was a fab box. The only thing in there that we're not probably going to eat will be the naked rendang veg pot. But I will pass it on to somebody who will eat that. Everything else is going to be absolutely demolished. The box value this month was £29.81p. So a bit in the higher end. You know, that's a wee bit higher than it would normally be. But I think that's because, you know, obviously the Kit Kats are £5 and the Costa Coffee is £5. Pounds fifty, So yeah, all round, I thought it was a smashing box. But like I said in the beginning, although I do get one cent for free from Degusta Box for review, I do have my own subscription running. So if you want to win yourself this month's box, all you have to do is leave a comment in the box underneath with the following sentence. I'd like to be entered and my favourite product in this month's box was and leave you know, leave your favourite product from the box. Let me know what it was. I'll leave the giveaway open for one week. So between now and next Tuesday, you will have to enter. And I'll announce the winner of the giveaway on the 1st of November at the end of my Sunday Meals of the Week video as usual. So good luck to everybody entering. The only stipulations are obviously you've got to be a subscriber and you've got to be within the UK because it's quite a heavy box and the postage to the likes of Australia or America or out with the UK would just be extortionate. So 
I do keep these giveaways within the UK, but other than that, good luck, and I will leave it open for a week and announce that winner on the 1st of November. So thank you all for watching, and have yourself a brilliant rest of your day, and I will catch up with you shortly, back here on What's For Tea. So take care, and bye for now. Bye now.